Hey, hey, what's happening here? Back for another question and answer. I owe an answer to a gentleman named Bruce who asked a question quite some time ago. I'm still catching up on lots of stuff here. So pardon me for the delays, but anyways, he wanted to know if he should get a computer science degree or software engineering degree because he wants to become a programmer, all right? And so <clears throat> both of those degrees handle um, application programming and design uh, in different in different uh, formats, um, different curriculum and all that, right? But let me say something about programming, okay? Programming, for the most part, for a lot of people, can be self-taught, okay? There are 10, 11, and 12-year-olds these days, right now, in 2016, that are writing applications, okay? with no formal schooling or anything. They are just picking it up on their own, you know, browsing the internet, figuring it out, okay, um, and running with it. So the point is that you don't really need a higher education if you just want to program in the future, okay? And that includes, you know, web development or software development or anything like that. Software engineer, Okay, it's just a fancy name for a person who knows how to write code. All right, that's really what it is. Okay, in its essence, they are just people that write programs. They write, and again, programs and software, same thing, right? They they are the ones that just write the programs, write the code, you know, do all the development and all that kind of good stuff. So really, it's the same thing. Okay, computer scientists, you know, they, that's just a fancy degree for someone that wants to get into application design as well. You know, they, they study other stuff as, as well during that, uh, you know, the course of that four-year degree pro program. But I would say that if you just want to become a coder, it's probably not necessary to get a four-year degree. Uh, you can easily go online and, you know, learn online through different types of courses. There's several different, you know, um, uh, websites out there that offer different courses for very relatively inexpensive uh, fees. You know, like Udemy and, and Udemy.com is one of them. Um, you know, just, just as an example. Now, if you want instructor-led classes, well then, you know, you can go to like a, a community college or a state college and start taking some you know, some introductory, introductory classes to programming, you know, and then just kind of take it from there and see if it's something that sticks, see if it's something that, that you're able to grasp a hold of. I mean, it's, it's not easy. Uh, learning different languages is, is, uh, it's not for everybody. Okay. Uh, it's certainly not for me. I just don't get that kind of stuff. Um, but, uh, you know, like I said, if, if you are a self-starter, self-learner, you can probably just go out and do it all on your own and, and figure it out, you know. Now, if you feel like it's important that you need the degree, then by all means go do it. You know, I'm not telling people not to go get degrees. I'm giving you a different perspective into the different areas of, of IT and just telling you that, you know, you don't necessarily need a four-year degree to become a programmer or application developer. Now, there are other job roles where you do need the degree, okay? And so it's, that's just what it is. So you gotta kinda figure out where you wanna be, what you wanna do. And uh, what I would suggest is that you go find someone that has gone through the software engineering and computer science degrees and just kinda get their perspective, get their opinion. Uh, find out what, uh, you know, what it entailed. Did they really need it? To get the job that they have as a programmer okay so that's that's really all there is to it uh, as far as becoming an, an application d designer uh, program programmer coder uh, software engineer all these fancy names for the same thing you know uh, so anyways um, <clears throat> that's pretty much it um, hope you uh, find this useful Bruce hope you're seeing this and anyone else out there that's uh, that's watching this I hope this this is uh, useful to you as well let me know in the comments below as always ask me questions down there 
You can send me a private message through YouTube. Uh, you can hit me up on the other platforms as well, Twitter and Instagram, which uh, you can find links to uh, on my main page. So I hope you're having a great, great day, and uh, we'll talk to you soon on the next Q&A. Thank you for watching. See ya.